Leo. Welcome to your love reading from now until May 2nd, 2022. Venus is in Pisces during this time. And Venus being all about love and romance is now in Pisces, which is about love and emotions. Um, so we're going to see when Venus is in Pisces, everybody's love life is going to be um, blissful. For those of you that are single, I'm going to do a singles read to see who's coming towards you during this time. But let's see what spirit wants to say. What's coming towards you from now until May 2nd? Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Spirit. Breathe. So I'm going to put that back in the deck because it didn't flip over. For Spirit, for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Thank you, Spirit. Happy, happy. Awesome. 26, card of 8, could be 4-4. Four, four. Got the rose quartz right here with us for love and romance. Bringing all that loving energy to my Leos. Spirit says one more. energy during this time. From now until May 2nd Spirit. Leo's energy during this time. The lovers. So you might, yeah, because Nine of Cups is at the bottom of the deck. You're feeling some kind of connection with someone. Definitely. Person in Leo's energy during this time. A person in Leo's energy for love and relationship during this time. Could be an air sign that's in your energy or an air sign that you're dealing with. Queen of Wands. Also could be a fellow fire sign. But this person has passion for you. What is the current situation, the current energy. Ten of Swords. So there might be an ending. Yeah, Ten of Swords. There might, be, there was an ending to this. An ending to this relationship with the Two of Cups at the bottom. But I don't feel like you're, you're you know, you're not over one another. You want to take a leap of faith towards one another again. Spirit, what is the advice? For Leo during this time. From now till May 2nd. The advice, Spirit. Okay, thank you. Two of Wands. Look, Ten of Cups is at the bottom and the Six of Cups. So for those of you who don't want somebody from the past, this might not be a reading, but there is somebody from the past that you're coming back in union with. And Spirit is telling you to ha have a plan, make a decision. The overall outcome between Leo and this person. Overall outcome for Leo and this person. Thank you, Spirit. Overall outcome is a brand new beginning with amazing co um, communication with communication that's going to make you feel whole, feel healed, have clarity. And it's going to be fast moving communication with the eight of wands at the bottom of the deck. Yep, things are definitely turning in your favor. All right, let's see if we can get any clarity on this. this person that Leo has this bond with. Please clarify the lovers for Leo. Lovers for Leo. High Priestess. Could be a spiritual connection for some of you. 
but it's like that that all knowing that you're not speaking to this person, but that this person definitely has a connection with you. Five of Cups. Yeah, you were torn apart when this fell apart. You were, you know, you were definitely feeling sad, feeling like, you know, why didn't this work out for the two of us? The wheel is in, turning in your favor, though, and there's that Ace of Swords again. Archangel Michael is going to be with you during this time. Can I please have another card for the lovers for Leo? One more card here for the lovers. All right, thanks, Spirit. Yep, Justice. Again, there was a cycle that ended, and there's this brand new cycle beginning. Please clarify the Queen of Wands for the person in Leo's energy. The Death card. The Look. So maybe it was your person, this person that wants to come back towards you. Maybe it was them who did not realize the feelings they had for you. You both are getting the lovers. So this could be a very deep, um, definitely a very deep connection. But for some of you, it could be the twin flame, you know, if you believe in that. If not, a soulmate connection is a very deep connection. They just weren't awakened to it. I feel like they, they did cause you some pain and hurt. Can you clarify the Ten of Swords? Spirit as the current situation. Ten of Swords. Yeah. When this was over, both of you, you know, you went in, it's like you kept to yourself. You spent time with yourself alone. Searched your soul, your soul searched your heart to try to find out, like, the meaning of this connection. If this is a spiritual connection, you reach out to your spirit source. For those of you, um, for those of you that are cross watchers, I feel like you did the same. But here is that all knowing, and they want to rush in. Leo, please clarify the two of wands for the advice spirit. Two of wands for the advice. Oh, look at this. This is the card that popped out. It's going to bring you nothing but happiness. And I feel like your last reading, the sun popped out. Make a plan. Make a decision. Cross watchers, make a plan so that you can come back to each other in a very supportive, concrete, um, abundant, grounded, connection. You might have had some distance between one another, like a little bit longer. I'm getting a year or two years because with the Knight of Pentacles at the bottom, whoa, with the Knight of Pentacles at the bottom, um, it's the slowest moving night. Yeah, there was, see this, I didn't ask any questions, but the Seven of Swords popped out. There was definitely hurt there were maybe things kept from you. Because I feel like they're the one that ended this. All right, can please clarify the Ace of Swords. You might have a child with this person, or they might have a child. You might have a child that's not with them, but there's a baby in this picture. Yep. There's hope here. Look at this. The Ace of Swords, you're each other's wish fulfillment. It's like you both took that pause and took that clarity that you needed. You just went within. You waited for the signs from spirit. You're breaking free from that illusion of being stuck without this person. Okay? Yeah, see? You love each other. All right, Leo. 
I'm going to get just a few more of these cards, just a couple of these cards to bring some additional clarity. Okay. Spirit, any other messages for Leo and this person? Look at this. Mask. Not showing true feelings. I really feel like that was your person, Leo. Palm trees. Stability, security, growth, endurance. That is what's coming back around for the two of you. But the palm tree, you might even be traveling towards this person if you're at a distance. And wedding rings is at the bottom. But even if that's not in your near future, union. It's this is coming back together. All right. And this is from now until May 2nd, 2022. Um, it's going to definitely be a happy time for you. You have the sun, the palm tree, the stars. Everything is working in your favor with you and this person. Okay. And I will do a singles read. Um, I will be back for many more readings. So love and light. Stay safe.